Hi, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. <laughs> you left us in Villa uh, Sumer, mm -hmm. and that's where we are still at the moment. Yes, we're still here. Shades are out, the weather is beautiful. Yeah. I hope it stays like this for five weeks, I'll be well happy. Yeah, it's, it's a lovely place so far. It's about 18, 19 degrees, but it feels like 20. Yeah, well you, you know think. what it's like when, when you're in a van, and um, yeah, it can get quite mm -hmm. warm. It's lovely though, I'm not complaining after the winter we've had. Yeah, so we're going to go and uh, have a little look around and take you with us. Hey, and it's done. Let's go. Ready. There's a path down there, that's that walk, I think. <clears throat> There's 14 um, pitches on here. It is an air. So we'll just have a quick look on here because I think on search for sites it was 13 euros last year. It's now 19 euros. Um, I'll show get, you that. You get what you pay for, I suppose. Um, but it is a basic air. It's a touchscreen as well. Um, I say two euros for water for six minutes. Yeah, that includes it. Is it, it says included, yeah. Okay. So that's what you get okay, for so your 19. 19 euros yeah. and you've got to be off by 12 o'clock the next day, otherwise your ticket rolls over. Yeah. Uh, and you have to pay again. That must be the bins for the air as well, just over there. Just yeah, there. they're always on the outside. Yeah, and they said there's a dumping ground out here somewhere. On the floor, maybe. I don't know, they said it was outside the air. So I don't know where that is. Yeah. This is the map. So where are we then, Lee, on this map? Hopefully there, where it says we are. <laughs> oh, well done. You can read French. <laughs> <laughs> or is it just a big red arrow? <laughs> yeah, so you've got this big, big park here. Yeah, we've seen people going past, haven't we, on them, <laughs> on them sort of cart things you get at campsites. Yeah, four-wheel carts. Yeah, yeah where they all have to pedal. Yeah. Um, see the horses go past, so there's like a little path that's side of us. Mm. And I think people are using that to get around and yeah. it looks up really nice. Yeah, so you've got one that you roll over, it's just outside and you just roll in and dump your waste and everything here, I think. Probably do your water as well. Yeah, the water. You've got a code on your receipt you need to put in, you get your water. That's obviously your toilet. And that's all right then. Yeah, it's all here then. Yeah, that's, that's good. good. that, we found it. Yeah, it's getting a bit worried then. <laughs> They're everywhere, so we'll find one. Yeah, yeah. Hey, look, we can come for a run down here tomorrow, right? Because I said okay. we we're going to do a bit of running while right. we're here. And there's a gym over there. Oh, wow. Okay. Some guys working out. So while you're running in the gym, I can video it. Is that what you're saying? No. No. You can uh, come with me. Lifeguard station. Yeah. Let's have a go and have a look at this sea. This looks beautiful. There's even kids building sandcastles. <laughs> We've got all these restaurants and cafes and things along here as well. That looks pretty uh, stunning in front of us. Did you say it was an Ibis hotel? No, that is. <laughs> oh, that is. <laughs> I was like, I can't, why does he say that, obviously? <laughs> You were meaning over there. It's an Irish hotel, but that's <laughs> lovely, that, yeah. Not bad for a beach house, is it? It's been stunning. Yeah, they're just, yeah, just... Like there. villas sort of things. Possibly, I mean, yeah. it's boarded up, uh, boarded up even, so I'm assuming it's like a holiday yeah. type place. Oh, found a pizza <laughs> vending yeah. machine. <laughs> is that what you want for your dinner tonight, then? Shall we come back and get one? Uh, prices, actually, yeah. So what's the... Half euro. Poss. Just don't, don't get anything with poss on because that's fish. Yeah. Well, these are meant to be really good. I've never tried one, so... Yeah. That's just for poss, it's just cheese. Yeah. I think that's like pepperoni. Ooh, I don't want... <laughs> well, you're buying it now. It, it looks quite nice, though. <laughs> <laughs> How much did you say they were? About, oh, 10, 10 euros, yeah. Oh, yeah. Three minutes cool. it's done in. That ain't bad, but it's probably putting people out of a job, isn't it?
estate agent behind us. I bet there's some really nice properties on there. Probably, while you're moving to France. <laughs> no, I just think some of these are absolutely stunning. Yeah, they're quirky, aren't they? Yeah, they're beautiful. I like that word anyway, quirky. quirky. Yeah, so they are, they are quite individual and unique buildings. Yeah. We're just surrounded by like stunning buildings yeah, at the moment. Nice. Lots to look at, isn't there? Yeah. And these yeah, are people, just people's houses or holiday homes or, yeah. you know. Um, I don't know if they rent them out or anything. I could possibly do that as well, but so they're just, everyone's different. They're just yeah. beautiful. Our first palm trees this holiday. <laughs> You've got more beach here. It goes it's on for ages, yeah. It goes right up there somewhere. <laughs> See, that's the coastline, so all yeah. the way down there. And then and all the way there. up there, yeah, beautiful. I do like this place, it looks very pretty. We thought we'd have a little chill out time. It's been a bit of a drive getting here. We didn't sleep too well last night, even though Canterbury was quite nice. Um, but it's nice just to get out and about. So we thought we're chill out and take in this view. So over there somewhere is the UK. But where are we? We're in the Normandy region, aren't we? Yeah. We're sort of um, not far from Omfleur. Not far, no, not yeah. far from Omfleur. So we've been to Omfleur last time and the drive down ain't that bad. And it's a nice stop, I think, if you're popping over first thing in the morning. Um, as the first stop, but we think we're only going to do one night. There is plenty to see here, and we're going to go in the town in a minute, but we're going to do one night stop here, and then we're going to push on round. Um, we're going to try and keep the drive in a bit shorter this time. Yeah, so we're going to... So it's yeah, quite a lot for you and the van, isn't it? Especially yeah. if it gets warm, so... Yeah, less hours driving, and yeah. more visiting places if we can. Um, until we hit Spain, Portugal. We have had some recommendations from some of the yes. viewers, which is great. It is we great, yeah. Try and get to some of them. Yeah, we'll, we'll let you know if we do. Yeah. But it's a noise to go across. <laughs> I'll let you know if we do, we'll give you a shout out. So thank you very much. Yes, definitely. I've got a list of um, all the places that we've been recommended uh, on the way down, so that's great. Um, but now we're going to enjoy this view and then have a little look in the town. So we think this is the start of the town and you've got the streets and stuff up there with shops and stuff. So we're gonna go and explore that, I think. It's quite nice, isn't it? This looks like one of the main streets of the town, doesn't it? It does, yeah. Is it only quite a small place? Yeah, I think it's just, um, Looking at it, there's just estate agents, a couple of shops that sell alcohol, a couple of clothes shops, stuff like that, and quite a few restaurants. This looks quite nice though, doesn't it? Got all mm. different flavours. Yeah. Nice. What would you like? Should we get one? Yeah. I like, um, I think I'd like a. Oh, I don't know. I'll have a look. Oh, a bar. It's shut. Well, what's over here for you? What have you found? Gin cactus. Right. Uh, I'm not quite sure what that says, but it's something to do with drinking. <laughs> might, be, might be for me, might be. That's another thing. We need to. We're not going to collect. Um, we're not looking at collecting fridge magnets magnets now, are no, we? Because we're moving house, so we've got an inbuilt fridge. On fridge, yes. Yeah. So we're going to look at a different one. So you got postcards is another option. Yeah, we were thinking about that. So yeah. this is something that we can do. So what about getting? We got a Normandy one. Yeah. Yeah. Pharmacy over there everywhere in um, in Europe aren't they always look out for the uh, you can look at them very easily well it's just really it's just looking out for the um, the crosses isn't it right. so what, you, you won't walk, go short you could walk past them in the UK couldn't you yeah that's strange. look at that little archway in a building there and then you've 
restaurant there. Oh yeah, restaurant there. There's more restaurants over here. What way do you want to go? Is that an old post office? The postie. Maybe it's not an old one, maybe it still is one. Oh, maybe, yeah. Could be, couldn't it? I'm just back down to the beach, so I think we're going to get ourselves, I know what we've got to do, we're going to get ourselves a postcard and we get them pizzas. Yeah, and we go let's back do to that. The van. Let's do that. We we've only just got here. We are tired. This is a lovely place. Yeah. I I would just like to go chill out in the van right now. Yeah. Um, stop walking around. Yeah. <laughs> I've been awake since we o'clock this morning, so we just want to show you a bit of this as mm. we experienced it. Yeah. So we're gonna do that. Head back right. to the van. Let's go. Yeah. We've actually realised that we actually need some food <laughs> for the van, <laughs> so we're just gonna. Yeah. Found a supermarket. Just in there. So we're not going to do the pizza tonight. We're going to grab some stuff. Is what well, I don't know where he's going. We're going to grab some stuff from in here, and then head back. They look nice, don't they? Yeah. Oh, they've got. Look, they have got bread. That's the proper sticks. Pop that one over. There we go. We'll have one of them. Okay. Uh, I don't know. We finished our shopping for today. Got some bits, haven't yeah, we? We have. Um, some wine and... And that reminds me <laughs> to bring my uh, my day sack, rucksack, whatever you want to call it, out. Yeah. Um, last time we was out, I always brought it, just in case you buy something. Forgot this time. Yeah. But we wanted to get out. So look for this place and uh, we'll catch you on our tomorrow um, later on. Yes, right. See you on our tomorrow. After some concerns about the coolant that I used to just top up because... Um, I didn't know that if you mix the different colours, um, it's just a thing I didn't know about coolant, that uh, it can turn it to gel or whatever. So um, I use this, this is what I put in there. Not a lot to be honest, um, hardly anything. Um, the coolant don't leak, but the service is every two years. We've done not far off 20,000 miles, so I thought, well, it was on the minimum, so I just thought I'd top it up just that little bit. Um, I've read the instructions, I've gone online onto their website and it does state that you can mix this stuff with any other um, type of coolant. It's got a, a painted, um, I suppose, part to it that um, no one else can copy. So, um, yeah, probably didn't need it, however, I just thought why not going on a long drive just to make sure I've got everything in the engine that's needed um, so I'm quite happy that that actually is fine but I, I did think I'll come and check the coolant um, and have a little look make sure it ain't turned to gel I've had a check of the coolant it's very much not turned to gel so um, live and learn on that one however it, you know, um, I did investigate oil, for example, because we all know a different engine takes different type of oil or what's better for it anyway. Um, so it's just uh, something else I'll make sure that I get the right stuff next time. The stuff that actually goes goes with it. But um, on these vehicles, you, you haven't got to have the service. Uh, I think it might be 20,000 miles to two years. So I'm, I'm coming up to my service time anyway. Um, but it's still looking good and gladly that stuff hasn't affected the engine. Thank you for the people that did reach out to me. I really do appreciate that and appreciate your concern. And it's something new to my knowledge bank. So thank you very much. Morning, just enjoying a coffee before we head out for a run. Yep, you heard me right, we're both going for a run. We are ready. Running kit's on. Um, this is a first for me. Not running. I don't do much running, bear, bear in mind, but um, I'm usually a cross trainer. Type of car, nice and chilled, but yeah, and can't bring a cross trainer with you in a motorhome, can you? So we're off for a run. Yeah, I've been doing a bit of running back home and I want to keep it up while I'm here. Um, and this has got a nice seafront area, like a promenade bit on. So um, we're going to have a little run around there. Um, and then hopefully tomorrow where we're going, we'll be able to do the same. Um, well, where we're going today, but tomorrow we'll be able to do the same. 
So this is a nice coffee, thank you. That's all right. Not a problem. Uh, you ready? Out. Yeah. yeah, I've got my trainers out, so I'm going to get them on. Um, yeah. Hopefully she don't uh, kill me. It's only a jog. <laughs> it's the word run, it's scary, but it's actually like a cross between a walk and a run, really, a jog. That's it. It's better than now, though, isn't it? Back from our run. Yeah, as you can <laughs> tell, even, I'm a little bit sweaty. Uh, I'm just putting these keys on here, but yeah, a little bit sweaty. It was a good run, actually. Three miles, exactly. Yeah, we headed off down one way down the um, promenade near the sea, but yeah. it was like, we're just going to have to turn around and come back the same scenery, so we Yeah, because it just keeps going, otherwise. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we cut into the National Park, so if you do stay on this air, which will be in the description. Um, there is a national park behind us as well, and then obviously you've got the seafront. Yeah, um, so we'll try and get out and show you a bit of that anyway, just mm. maybe one of the lakes out there. Yeah, um, yeah. We'll, we'll see if we can do that once we've got showered and changed before we leave here. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, I'll so. have a shower now. Oh, it's drying his t-shirt from the run this morning. Yeah, <laughs> It will be getting washed. <laughs> Just a bit wet. Right, let's go and show you a bit of this national park. So this so, is the national park. So how do you say that? Park, park. Naturel du Maris. Maris. Ah. Maybe you've got it right. Maybe. Maybe you haven't. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a lovely park actually. It's just behind the um, the air. So you've yeah. got the like we said before, seafront and all this. So it's lovely. Yeah, it's a lovely place to visit. And this is where you can hire out them buggies. Yeah. I've seen a few of them going past the back of the air. Uh, and not only that, not only can you ride them around the National Park, we have seen people going up and down the promenade strip on them buggies as well. Yeah. Actually on the road, and the cars having to go around them. Yeah, you get bikes here as well. Yeah. You're getting one. Haven't you got a walk over there, Lee? Yeah, no, I'm not getting a bike, no. <laughs> so you can hire these bikes out. There's bikes in there, to be honest. So there is the, there is the dinosaur on the um, roundabout, and you've got one here. So you've got this centre. So we'll have a little look at Go and have a little look at this, see what this is about. Pale space. I'm assuming it's a, a Jurassic coastline of some sort. Just like Maybe. Uh, in the UK. Oh, look, something's <laughs> been here. <laughs> so it looks like just at the back of the air as well, we've got this museum for the dinosaurs and that sort of era. Um, we're looking around about 12 euros 50 oh. per adult. The car park for the museum. And then they've got these toilet blocks. So yeah, they're the ones that clean themselves after use and they get disinfected. But, you know, they are just behind the, the air. I'm not sure if we can use them or not. I think you can. I think it's you just, just press, a case of, Yep, they're yeah. open. <laughs> so it has got public toilets that are quite clean, disinfected, just behind the air if you need them. And then you've got this beautiful view here as well. So I think they're basically for the National Park area, the museum and just the whole area maybe. Yeah, and if you actually keep the toilet door open slightly, as Jodie said, you've got this beautiful <laughs> view while you're on the throne. So we're very quiet. And you look here and you see this fence. You sort of wonder why they've blocked that off. Actually, just over there, they're respecting the privacy of the swan and letting it nest. Didn't see that. So I think it's looking after some eggs. Um, so they've actually cordoned it off for the swan so no one disturbs it. I think that's great. We're going to head back to the van now. We are. Because we yeah. want to um, dump the waste and fill it with water uh, just outside so we can get off and let other people get on. Yeah. Um, and then. We're heading to our next destination. Yeah. It's a good air though, we had a good sleep there, no noise at all. No. It was really pleasant, no. wasn't it? Yeah. yeah, lovely. So it is 19 euros, but you say yeah. with so the water. So about 16 and pounds 20p. With electric though, you know, so yeah. it's not too bad for a night, couple of nights if you're up this area. Yeah. 
and there's yeah. plenty to see and do. Mm -hmm. um, there's restaurants and shops and supermarkets, yeah. the beach, so this the, national park. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, the town's about a 25-minute walk. Yeah. So, uh, but it's up the coastline, so it's mm. quite a, a nice walk to do. Yeah, in the nice weather. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Or you can cycle up there, whatever. Yeah. But yeah. But so you can even hire a bike from here if you haven't got one, just at where we've just gone past at the back of the air, and use that. Yeah. <laughs> if you needed. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so it's really, it's really good. You do have to be off by. I think we've already said, but by twelve o'clock, because your ticket renews, mm -hmm. um, and your number no longer works, so you can't get off the site. No, <laughs> um, which means if, you have to pay for another twenty-four. Yeah, hour to get another pin number to get off the site. Yeah. <laughs> so, right, we're going to go and do that, and we'll. Uh, It's noisy over he there. He wants to be on camera. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll uh, we'll see you when we get to our next destination. We're heading yeah. south. Let's see if we can get out because it seems to be people waiting to come in. Then it waiting for a card. Bit of a tight squeeze to get out. But I need to put the card in to leave, so they're going to have to move. I've been there quite a while actually, so I don't know what the score is. Whether they wait until twelve o'clock or whatever, I don't know. Right, I'll show you how to do the pin. Put this pin in that's at the bottom. It's nine, six, six, seven, eight, one. Uh, validate, there we go. Exit. There we go. Got there in the end. <laughs> yeah, Lee's gonna go and do the services now. Looks like there's a few people. You for the services, maybe? Ah, oh, sorted. Let's just get in the hose out. Yeah, I'm really to give this drawer a clean actually because in the winter months it gets all a bit corroded. However, if you get bored at any point, it's a job to do, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, we won't be that bored, but. No. Yeah. So this is just the way you dump your waste, fill up your water. It's just outside the air, so it's pretty cool. Uh, to press her, yeah? on the button, push. I think it only lets you do it once. No, it doesn't. It gives, it gives you a second. Um, you only get it once for six minutes. When did you use it earlier? To do the loo. So what, you only get it once and you stay? And if you need to empty the loo a couple of times... Well, it should be, your actual water should be six minutes. Yeah, Press on the I button to push, hang on, that's that one. That's that button over there. You can pay two euro, I think, but I don't know how you do it. So you could look, there's, um, there's no, that's, a, that's something else. So we can't fill water up then. No, we're going to have to get somewhere else to fill water. So what normally happens is you put your pin in here and you do get six minutes of water, but Lee said he used it earlier on to rinse out the toilet. The toilet. So now we've come in... that side. Yeah. Now we've come in and done the... So you only get it once. That's a bit rubbish, really, because you might need to empty your toilet a couple of times. Well, you think you'd get an empty toilet and a, and a water thing, wouldn't you? Yeah. So once you've pressed it, you've pressed it, so just be careful of that one. Yeah. We'll have to fill up somewhere else then. Yeah, you do get six minutes um, constant water within your stay and you have to use that before 12 o'clock as well and your pin code runs out. Uh, but like we've just said, make sure you don't use it for your loo water because you won't get it for your main water, which is very annoying. Luckily on the search for sites, so on the next site we're staying on, or it's actually, you know, um, free parking place has got water. Oh, has it? I was going to ask yeah, you that. It's on, it was on the search for sites and it's one of their little tick logos that there's water there. So even though it's free... And even it's... though it's free, I think there's water. You might have to pay for the water like a couple of euros, I don't know, but um, there is water there, so we can do it there. Oh, good. I was just going to ask where we're going to get it from, because I didn't think they'd have it there, but um, yeah, well, uh, I'll check that out first, to just make sure. So we're heading sort of mid-France, around Le Mans area, uh, location-wise around there. Um, yeah. We'll show you probably when we get there. It's not actually in Le Mans, it's just on the outskirts. Um, and we're just going to go and find some fuel, so we're just heading on to a main motorway. Yeah, so I think so. I think CA13 we're getting taken on now, soon. 
There'll be a fuel station there, so that'll be fine. Yeah. Fill up with some fuel. It's the first time we've filled up in France since we've been over here, so I've still got 100 miles left in the tank. So all good. Yeah, so we're back on the roads. Uh, that fuel cost us 135 euros, and you filled it up, didn't you? Yeah, filled to the brim. Uh, it's not far off, pretty much like the UK, really. It's what I pay there, so no real difference. And that was, um, I don't know, it's their like, motorway to, uh, service station. So they are a little bit more expensive. I only got about 10 cents. Yeah, it so. works at about £115 in uh, our money. Yeah. So that's that's pretty good. Okay, see the road is. And look at this weather as well, look at that. I think it's just us driving this way. Looks like no one else is on the road. Oh, there's a car. <laughs> yeah. Felt off so I can reach over. That's what that noise is. I'm just going to get the toll. So, yeah, I should be able to reach that one second. So the noise Oh, I can't get it. One second. It will be if I can reach the bloody. No, I'm gonna. I can't use that. Can I back the minute? Well, I parked a little bit too far away this time. I think, they, I think they see your backside. That's the toll backside. Right. <laughs> Camera back. <laughs> Let's go. Seatbelt on. Seatbelt on. And we're off again. We want a more scenic route now we've come off the main toll roads heading southwest slightly just saying how pretty it is when you come off the main roads yeah. it's lovely look how wide the roads are it's lovely and i'm still in cruise control just letting it do its thing just been through a really pretty little village and it had um, a motorhome dumping area, servicing area and there was actually like a little park with a picnic bench and people there and they'd park the motorhome right next to it. <laughs> so, yeah. so it's uh, very motorhome friendly. <laughs> Just look at the roads, smooth as anything. I'm not saying all of them are but majority Camping park. Right, so we're here. So this is a free park. Yeah. You can go, go there's some motor rooms up there. Lisa's going to go and see if we can find somewhere to park us up. I am, yeah. And there's a service point just in front of us. And then there's some other motor homes just parked there. So we've <laughs> we got settled in eventually. Next destination. So <laughs> La Saba. Oh, we're not in Spain yet, are we? That's <laughs> Savessa, anyway. Savessa. <laughs> Not Savessa. I'll get it right in the end. In French, Sava means uh, you okay, Sava. Oh, right, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay now. Yeah, we've got a nice spot here. <laughs> I'm not actually asking you if you're okay. <laughs> but yeah, good. Um, it's nice and flat, actually. Um, another motorhome, they did say they went on the grass area, uh, got stuck, so uh, we're not going on there. But as long as you're, you can park pretty much anywhere in here, so yeah. spaces for hard standing are a little bit limited. Just be respectful um, to the motorhomes and people manoeuvring. Yeah. But yeah, so they told us all that in French. So yeah. that was. Uh, so where are we? <laughs> didn't they? Yeah, they did. Oh, yeah, they, they all in French. So I know I was a little like, bit. Ah, Google little, Translate, where are you? I know a little bit, so um, I could sort of work out and, and body language and pointing and things like that. Yeah. Um, so they basically, yeah, they got stuck in over there, so they moved over here, and this is really mm. good where we're parked. That's what they yeah. said, basically. So, so we are finishing this vlog here. We're um, just, we're just, you asked me where we were, sorry. We yeah, are just, so um, where to, are we first? If you're um, coming down the country, um, we're just to the right of Le Mans. Uh, Le Mans, and I can't remember what the place is called, but we will Ooh. put it. We will put it on the screen, so yeah, <laughs> and in okay. the description as well, so it's you can going see where on it is there now. It is a free park up, um, and it's just on the way. On the it was on the route we were taking. Yeah, uh, heading southwest. So yeah, um, um, but you'll get more of um, this area on the next vlog. Yes, definitely. So, so that's it. We're going to settle down now and. Uh, start vlogging for the next one <laughs> <laughs> so thank you again to everyone that has subscribed to the channel and all your support we will see you on the next vlog so see you then bye see ya oh au revoir au revoir <laughs> <laughs>